Well, hello everyone. How are you doing? It is I, Father Francis, and uh, yes, I am uh, just putting up a little uh, new video <clears throat> using the iPod Nano, the new iPod Nano. And I think this uh, actually might be um, a way of kind of having a little <clears throat> hip pocket video camera with you at all times. Uh, certainly, it's not HD, uh, that's to be sure. Uh, we're not working with Carl Zeiss lenses here, that's to be sure. But I have to say that the video and the audio quality is not bad. Uh, so if someone wanted to do like a little interview or you're on the go, uh, kind of like a little travel video kind of thing, <clears throat> this might be uh, an answer. I was using the Kodak ZI6 for a while. But uh, that uh, had some uh, had some limitations, <clears throat> uh, notably the the batteries, and uh, also the uh, the storage. Now you can get SD cards, obviously now, <clears throat> which are you know eight and sixteen gigabytes, and uh, that seems to be um, takes care of its uh, storage capacity for video. But um, but it does have some other problems that uh, I won't go into now. But uh, this little camera here seems to be, um, I think, a respectable little alternative. Certainly I wouldn't uh, maybe do uh, uh, a lot of videos using it uh, on a more of a professional basis. But again, from time to time, uh, it might uh, be a nice little way to kind of shoot off a couple little video messages uh, that uh, can, uh, you know, quickly be uploaded. Um, one of the things about the little iPod Nano <clears throat> I'm going to try and uh, one of the things I noticed is that it uh, does it actually has a pretty good little camera camera stabilization uh, which I think is really nice um, but uh, when you connect it to your Mac um, you would think that it would go right into iTunes but it actually uh, for some reason uh, the videos are uh, kind of uploaded to iPhoto <clears throat> and why I don't know they are mp4 uh, files so you would think that they would automatically uh, navigate to uh, to itunes but that's not the case and uh, so when you're trying to upload and uh, <clears throat> uh, try to find the videos uh, for editing in imovie um, i did try uh, importing them into um, i wonder if that's going to put a shadow that's probably going to put a little shadow there on my light um, <clears throat> and when you try to upload them um, or in, uh, load them into uh, Final Cut Pro, uh, for some reason they don't render out. I don't know exactly why. Um, but uh, maybe somebody can tell me. Anyway, the bottom line is that this seems like it's a little, uh, pretty good a little alternative for a camera, a little uh, hip pocket camera on the go. And um, again, it's, uh, it's just a little novelty, certainly. But it's a lot of fun. So hopefully uh, you'll get something out of it. And uh, maybe you'll decide you want one too. I don't know. But uh, they're a lot of fun. Okay. Take care. Bye-bye. See if I can turn this off now.